busy making shots or tired of rotoscoping yourself in After Effects or want to know how to auto cut yourself in a faster way without using After Effects? Well, in this video, I got this thing covered. With this one software, we can do this in a much faster way without using the rotoscoping tool in After Effects. Let's get started. Hi guys, Pistol Sammy here. And the reason I have been MIA for the past few months is because I have been making one of the best and biggest YouTube video editing agency out there. Let it be your long form videos or your short form videos. I got you guys covered. So if you're someone who is actually looking to get your videos edited to get leads and eventually, you know, make more money, then you know that the contact details are there below do make sure to check out back to the video so for this one trick we are going to use this software called CapCut and yes it has a desktop tool as well it is available for both Mac as well as Windows if you are someone who is living in India yes the official website is not available in India but you can use all the third party websites to download this software it is totally free of cost now once you guys have installed your CapCut software we are going to do this in two simple steps step one open your CapCut software drag your footage onto the CapCut software now this should be the trimmed down footage from your original video editing software. Let it be Final Cut Pro, Premiere Pro, DaVinci, etc. But it should be the trimmed down footage because we are going to use this footage later on in the later edits in our main editing software. So in CapCut, you drag the video file and once that is done, go to this panel right here, which is on the right hand side. Go to the cutout panel and then make sure to tick mark the auto cutout option. Once that is done, wait for a bit and viola, your entire background is removed. Just to be clear, this is only for face of human beings to be cut out. No objects or anything else will be available for this one feature. Only your human faces will be cut out. And that is it for the first step. This is very easy to use. Now, the problem here is it is in CapCut software. The transparent layer is also in CapCut software. It is not in your favorite software like Final Cut Pro, Premiere Pro, etc. So what to do? You have to export this in a very different way so that you guys can use it in Final Cut Pro or in Premiere Pro. And we're going to do this in step two. Let's jump into step two. Now step two in CapCut software is very easy to do. The first thing which we are going to do is just simply use a green screen. That's it. Download any kind of solid green background from the internet just like this. Drag it onto your CapCut software under the main layer. Increase its scale if it's not in proper size and then save it. Export this timeline from your CapCut software. Open it in your favorite video editing software. In my case, it is going to be Premiere Pro. Now, in Premiere Pro, it is very easy to do. In your main original timeline, just drag this one footage above your main timeline and then just simply use chroma key. Just go to your effects panel, use chrome key and just choose the color just like this and your background will be removed. Now you have two layers, one with the original background, second with the transparent background and any kind of effects, any kind of shorts you want to make with this effect, you guys can simply hide the main layer and that's it. Use a transparent layer, put any kind of graphics on the background and you are very much good to go. And it is a very simple thing to do. If you want to do the same thing in File Cut Pro, just simply do the chroma key effect and you are good to go. In Fire Cut Pro also there's an inbuilt method, in Premiere Pro also you can do this with rotoscoping in After Effects. Both of these techniques are very much lengthy to do and takes a lot of time to do and has very specific requirements to do as well. Don't even tell me what rotoscoping takes, it takes forever to just get a proper masking right and if you are someone who is a video editor out there, you will understand my pain a lot. So with that being said, those were the two steps to do this guys. If you guys found this helpful then do make sure to comment down below, let me know what you guys think about it and if you are someone who wants to take your content creation to the next level and just want to remove video editing out of it i'm here to help you guys take your video editing needs all of the way to a next freaking level and help you get more leads and clients if you're someone who is in need of video editing then drop a comment down below and make sure to reach out to me i'll definitely help you guys with that being said i'm pixel sammy we'll be back with a new video soon peace out